Today we're going to show you how to correctly measure your dog's neck so that you can get the right size dog collar. This is Flint. She's a three-year-old Labrador, one of my dogs. She's going to help us out today. It's really important that your dog's collar fit correctly, especially if you're walking them on a leash or if you're going to be putting them on a stakeout chain. Any situation where the dog may want to back out of the collar, if the collar's on them too loose, then they have that opportunity to, to back out of it. I also, I, I like a collar that I have some flexibility as far as the sizing goes so that I can tighten it up or loosen it depending on what we're doing. Now I'm going to show you how to measure your dog's neck. I'm using you know, just a, a seamstress tape. What this is, you know, it's flexible, easy to measure with. If you don't have one of these, you can use pretty much any kind of string. Anything you can easily wrap around the dog's neck, make a mark, and then measure it with a standard tape measure. Dog's necks are narrowest at the, the base of the skull, and then as you get closer to the shoulders, they start to get wider. And so you've got to decide where you want your collar to sit on the dog's neck and how tight you want it to be. I'm going to go at about the middle of her neck, and we're going to get it relatively tight. A tight measurement on her is about 16 inches. So based off of that measurement, Flint's neck's going to be a 16. Now, the collar that I'm using today is our leather collar with nameplate. It comes in four different sizes. The smallest size is a 15 NS, which stands for neck size. So it all comes back. Neck size is the important thing when you're looking at our collars. Everything's based off of neck size. So the smallest collar is a 15 neck size. Now she could wear a 15 neck size. We've got it right here. But in a 15 neck size, she's gonna come up for me in the last hole. Now I could get her to the second hole, but that's gonna be a little on the tight side. So that's not really what I'm looking for. If I go with this collar and I put her into the last hole, that doesn't give me any wiggle room if I need to go any, any tighter or any looser. So our next size up is gonna be a 17 neck size. And best bet, that's where we're gonna end up. Mm. 17 neck size on her is pretty comfortable. We're in the middle hole. I've got one more hole to go that I could do if I have to to tighten her up, that I'm going to be comfortable. That's about as tight as I'm going to want it on her. And in that position, it's not going to hang out too bad. So if I was putting her on a stakeout chain, I would probably go to that. She's not a dog that's typically going to fight a stakeout chain too much, so that's not a problem. But she's going to fall into the middle hole right there. Rotates around her neck good. It'll come off if I really fight with it, but not easily. So on a 16 inch neck, that's what I'm looking for right there. 